behavior and just, I guess you wrong for calling it out. There's more stuff. We're going to take a look at it, though. Let's see. We have gotten confused. My lack of... <laughs> you said about my lack of edges. Your lack of edges? You are, <laughs> what are you talking about? He said, you might have gotten confused by my lack of edges. You got a lack of edges? That's crazy. I don't care what was said. The fact the call was made was bad enough. Yeah, I agree. I don't think you should be trying to get people to lose their children because you mad. <laughs> like, how dare you speak about me on YouTube? Let me get your kids taken away. What? Like, that's so evil. That's so evil. Evil, like who? Hey, Laura. Hey, hon, like how are you? I'm good. All right, so, so I evil. just woke up a little while ago and <laughs> saw the title. I said, Oh, here we go. Mm -hmm. And then I decided to listen to some of it. See, Laura joins Say Robbie's panel to clear up the misunderstandings again. Oh, no. Oh, no. And I heard German lady on. And oh. I know you guys are like way past this. I just want to address a couple of things. Oh, of course. That need to be addressed. <clears throat> Everyone's judging me on my initial <laughs> my reaction. Lack of edges? That's hilarious. Yeah, it was no edges. You're right. Shoot, my edges ain't there either. Everybody's so makeup lobster thing. Yeah. Okay. Everybody's initial reaction would be like, whoa, you were just fucking burned by someone that you trusted for years and you weren't burned because of her own conscience. You were burned because you pissed her off due to taking away someone's wrench. It was all revenge. Um and so I woke up me. to this. Oh, hold yeah, on just for me. And and I woke up okay. to this. So my initial reaction was a knee-jerk reaction, but I wasn't the first, I mean, it was years ago, I but I wasn't the first CPS yes. caller. I certainly won't be the last, but you know what I was the first of? Someone that was fucking, that owned it immediately without, wow. question. not one of these motherfuckers would ever admit that they did that. I, I took it. I so who else did it? So who else did it? If you want to make it right, who else did it? It was you and a group of friends, right? Who did you help do that? That honesty is the best policy, and I fucking owned it, which is more than anybody in this motherfucking community has ever done. So they can kiss my motherfucking ass. Yeah, YouTube is disgusting. Well, yeah, what I was saying is I don't. I mean, I've it. only heard bits and pieces. Not even just YouTube, the internet, right? There's a lot of nasty people on here, and they get away with a lot of stuff. Say Robbie, Laura. I don't even care because there's so many fucking people. Like I was talking about earlier, like Man Mandolin. Wow. Yep. She went after your fucking kids and your yep. family. Sure did. And Ooh. she's talking about this on her channel with well, Hucker's channel, and. Wait, so is right what Laura did? Because a whole different. Why well, say Robbie always do that? Why does he always do? It? So because someone else did something uh, allegedly, it's right for Laura to call CPS on a whole different person. So wow. I was asking earlier, even on Darlene Nikki's, because they That's were talking crazy. about it, and I said, "Hey, I love Laura." That's it. And they were giving their opinions and stuff. And I don't know how, how many years ago was it? Three. 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 Almost, it was just about three, like two and three quarters. Okay. He's and so one, one, one. for people that may not know what happened. So it was just like a CPS call, right? It was a CPS and call. And I'm not trying to brush it off. Like it's nothing, but three years ago. And the reason why I did it though, when she had got swatted, it was other that I had nothing to do with, but when she had gotten swatted, her husband it was like, get off the internet. So she was off the internet for a little while. Now, when she there's a long backstory behind it, but she came after me hard, and we were really good friends. I mean, you know that. So and she got swatted, and you still did this to her. What's wrong with Laura? She came after me hard, and it was every single so fucking nasty. Day, 365 days of nonstop harassment. And what people forget, and I don't know why so many people forget this, but they do. If you target someone on the internet, it doesn't matter who it is, a single mom with kids, uh, any single mom with kids. And you target them every single day. You are literally trying to hurt their children because you're trying to take money out of their pocket. You are taking money out of their pocket. You're trying to what? bash them. You're doing all these things to fuck. Oh my gosh. No. If someone talks about you, they're attacking your children. Kid, I, but then hold on. Hold on. Let's, let's say in a hypothetical crazy land world, that's true. What they got to do with you calling CPS on their kid? How did, what? And it's not true. Just because someone talks about you, you talk about people. So, so wait, so then you attack people's children then, right? Like what? Say Robbie does that too. With them where you would say, oh, well, I'm going after the adult. No, you inadvertently are going after their kids. And I don't know why so many people don't get this. All I wanted was for her to shut the fuck up. Leave me alone. 
And every single day, her, Mandy Lynn, Hello Star, all of them, every fucking day. Nobody cared what it was doing to me. Nobody gave a shit if it had an effect on me. They didn't care. They didn't care if they were taking money out of my kids' mouths, even though at at that time. Oh, how is them doing a video doing? Like, come on. Time, I was still working another job, but they had no care for my mental health, what I was going through every day. Now is meant to her. Yo. Yo, does she care about the mental health of anybody? Like, come on, bro. This is, she's just playing the victim. Just this is wanted nasty. her to shut the fuck up. And that's why I did what I did. After I did it, I regretted it. I said, I, I cannot believe I even wow. went this far. I can't believe that I fucking did this. She's and we put it aside. Horrible. And everyone that was like, rah, rah, rah. now we're all like, the bitch fucking deserved it. Somebody had to make a shot. Hold on, I have to pause you. Uh, guys, Laura oh. is my good. She says she deserved it. And he tried to save her. So now you're saying she deserved it. Wow. Laura, why? What? friend up outside of youtube she's been we've been great to each other for many since probably the beginning just a couple rough patches so she is welcome to say what she wants i had to block a few comments but go ahead am i cursing too much no it's just like you're just speaking your mind and that's you're allowed to do that so i mean did people want me to cry and and be like all these fake ass bitches and cry hysterically and be like oh my god i can't change what happened in the past the Mm -hmm. only thing that i could do is change myself and that is exactly what i did I, then she proceeded to talk about me for 365 days for the last three years. And I never called again. I just learned to ignore her. So when we have people... You didn't change yourself, though. You're the same nasty you always been. What are you talking people about? People hear my attitude. People hear my defense. Yes, I am defensive. Why? Because... I know how much I've changed and all these fake people who've done worse, who've sat in panels of way worse, want to judge me, kiss my fucking ass. Well, what, I I did, well, what I did was wrong. There's no excuse for it. And I'm not making any excuses for it, but nobody has a right to judge you until you're in that position. And until you're there, don't say what you're going to do. Well, and Laura, there's a lot of people that have, because I've always said, as far as where I came from on YouTube, the OGs, like, you know, people say, oh, you know, I love Natasha, but like Natasha is the big one or Bullhorn and Betty or all these people that came later. The original OGs that ran, if you want to say the word community, were Molly, what? Laura, Makeup Mobster, Pink Lady Luck. You know, she kind of got yeah. in there and Diane's channel. That was it. Everybody else, we were all beneath kind of watching, witnessing, and we saw everything that was going on. Now, before my fucking cherry got popped and I snapped on people, I was always trying to make, you know, trying to help people get along. And I will say, like, I've always liked Makeup Mobster, but she Man, always denied peace. Shut up she always kept going. Yep. Um, and she just kept... He ain't help nobody. Listen, say Robbie don't never help nobody. I mean, he just tries to help himself. Fucking going. And I would even talk to her outside of YouTube and on YouTube and be like, dude, can you just stop or this? And Molly was always the first one to say, sure, no, I'll stop. And she wouldn't. So nope. you guys have to understand, like, I don't even know the exact what? details of what happened or what you got. We're going to get to that. I'm going to pull that up. Yes. Pull that up. But you guys have to fucking understand when people poke and poke and poke and poke and poke and poke and poke, you snap. And then you this nigga say you don't know the details when she just told you, well, she probably lied on how, but she just told you she did it. You don't know the details. This thing is on accountability later, whether it's three years later or not. Sometimes you don't tell people at all until it gets exposed. Mm-hmm. So okay. I'm not, I don't fucking judge you for that because first of all, it was three years ago. Second of all, I, I have seen makeup monster poke the fuck out of people. And we're not, we're not even talking like a YouTube beef where a lot of these people that are judging me can't handle someone talking about them for a week, let alone four years, let alone at that time. Was- I wouldn't give a damn, bro. I'm going to be honest with you, pimp. Right, as long as they're not lying, just a friend, that's a different thing. That would be defamation. But if they're not doing that, nigga, I don't care. I don't the know. year. As long Every- as they're standing in the guidelines, they're making it fair use too? Yeah, I don't care. Single fucking day. All right, and hold I- on. Let's clear this up. Your intention, was your intention to hurt a child, Laura? Not at all. Okay, Good. there you so go. What, what? Nothing to do with hurting a child. Yeah, sorry, what, Hold on then. So what was the intention then? Right. That's a good well? question. She said, what was the intention? To get her to shut up about me. I, oh, let me, no. let me, and there was a lot, first of all, you guys, there was a lot of negative shit back then. Like a lot of, I think everybody on this panel pretty much was not there back then. A lot of people how in the chat, was, I've never, how was that going to get her to shut up? Like go deep, explain. Seen back then there was a lot of like back then people didn't really go real life, uh, a little bit, but they would bring, it was a little bit more PG than it is now, but they were brutal. Mm-hmm. But not only that, I'm not saying that makeup monster has gone real life, but by doing the things that make makeup monster has done or said you lead people wow. into wanting to go real life on others. Yep. So when you get pushed to that point, Yo, wow, this man is nasty. 
blame the person that you did the thing to. Like I've been to that point and I've dodged the fuck out of people and I have no fucking regrets because I'm like, dude, if you're going to do it to me or fuck me over and try to fuck my life. You hear him? This is, this is why I called into his stream. Oh, my bad. Not called in. I clicked into his stream and went into the live chat. This is why. Because he just lied. I never did anything to him besides do a video talking about him. That's it. That is it, bro. Life up. I'm doing it to you. It's not, it's not okay wow. what I have. But anyways. Sorry. Can I just want to say something for a second? He did say he wanted to yeah, so let my life If up. she's got beef with the mother, then why bring a child into that beef? Why use a child right. as a weapon towards someone on this platform when they well, have again, nothing to do but your mindset three on. years ago uh, three, three years later so. that's still no excuse though robbie yo wise whoa say robbie's jumping in let her answer but your nasty ass trying to defend her disgusting behavior let her answer no it's not an excuse but like three years ago i've done fucked up shit to people that i would never I mean, do today I mean, listen what I mean, happening? what's actually going on Robin's in the chat and she should tell you and people have heard me say that I was going to call CPS on her and Robin knows me. We've known each other a long, long time. We did have yes. our fucking out and what have you and I did threaten it but it, I threatened it because I was backed into a corner but I would never have done it but I knew by just threatening her it would hopefully get her to stop the, what was going That's on disgusting. at the time. But I mean, right. obviously, Robin, Robin knows that I would never have done it but it was like a threat. Can I just say one more thing though uh, and I... I respect everybody's opinion on this, but yeah, I would never do that. And guys, people have done and said the most disgusting things about me ever, fam. I would, I wouldn't call CPS to try to get their kids taken away, right? I wouldn't do anything like that. I wouldn't dox them, right? So I don't want to hear no excuse. If I, someone who's had the worst things ever done and said about them on YouTube, some people have tried to fight me in real life, have run up on me and tried to swing. Right, type of ish, right? But I didn't let them chase their ass. They was in the car too. But yeah, right? Like, and I'm still saying I wouldn't do that. Then there's no excuse for Robbie or Laura. No Witnessing excuse. back then, like it was, it was a much it smaller just, community. Yeah, and uh, I'm not trying to compare and discredit anybody else because they're married or have a husband. But Laura has been a single fucking mother of three children for a long time. And they're finally off what? to college and stuff like that. I have witnessed no, this. two of them are. Not very. Just okay, two of them. Okay. Home. okay. What they got to do uh, anything? And I have witnessed her be a single mother while she's having trolls come in her chat threatening her because of other channels attacking her. <laughs> and all this fucking bullshit. So her being a single mother <laughs> makes her exempt from people going and giving their opinions or even trolls. Trolls go at everybody, bro. Like, stop it. So you guys have trolled people. You gotta cut. She's a single mother. <laughs> Have and a five CPS saying, calls that I got. Yeah, I'm not saying that's an excuse. Okay. Yeah, okay. But what I'm saying is, is there is, and I will say You're this with my face. If you provoke the fuck out of me, and I don't care if you say, just say it in my well, chat, if you fucking tell me you're coming after my family, you better bet your fucking ass that I'm going to dock shores okay. or I'm going to do something else. And I don't care who they are. And that's present day. We're talking about years ago. Oh, that's I would say, I would say this, right? Well, if you're a belligerent person, I will call CPS on you too. Because if you're showing unstable behavior and you're fucking what? screaming all the time and you have kids, right? Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay. But that's that's one way. But what you've got to okay. look at it as well, right? Hey, Robbie, if you ever have kids, remember that you said that. I ain't gonna be the one to do it, but I guarantee you somebody's probably gonna call CPS if you ever have kids, right? Right. I wouldn't be surprised if they don't call the cops to get a wellness check on you, right? The way you act. So to say something that crazy is nuts, bro. I just, I think that's wild. This is is virtual reality, right? If it gets so bad, Especially and I'm, I'm, I'm not, because I don't know Laura, character. but I know that if I was a single mother of three, well, I do, and she's it's a good so person. bad on here, I would turn the switch off. I don't care what you want to do. Single mother means <laughs> you, you get no criticism at all. It's a shield. No one could ever say anything to you. Your income, you can't. But this isn't an income. I'm sorry. It, income. it is to Laura because she also does her candle business, and she. Yes, I know, it. but this isn't. You, look, we've seen we've seen uh -huh. channels out there that have got millions of subscribers and lose it just like that. You cannot use this yeah. as an income. You have other sources. I use this as part of my mm. business, part of my business, because I rely. I don't think it's dependable. It is, of course, you can use it as income, um, but I do think that you should diversify, right? 100% diversify for sure because in any moment it could be over but this is a conversation that has nothing to do with anything at all I don't know why they let Robbie literally jump in front of 
Laura, so she wouldn't answer the question, and now they're talking about something that got nothing to do with anything. Like, on my other business elsewhere. Just this here it. isn't real life, and I'm sorry, but if your children, you feel that your children are being threatened like that, turn the damn thing off. That's what I'm going to say. You guys have to remember, this is not present day. This is three years matter, ago. Robbie, 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 it doesn't matter whether it was 10 years ago. If you feel that you're being... To me, it does. Oh, no, 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 Robbie, you haven't got children, right? That's no disrespect to you. No, but like Nikki said, I have oh. animals, and if... if, if uh, yeah, if I'm getting away. Right. This nigga said, no, I got animals. <laughs> children are not... I get what you're trying to say. Children are not animals. Also, your hamsters wouldn't uh, equate to a child. I don't think so, but okay, all right. Okay, I get what you, I guess you love your hamsters, right? Uh, That's a comment real quick. Uh, Nikki said, That's imagine crazy. if AJ called animal services. Well, guess what? AJ is a fucking troll. There's bitches that want to fuck with people online. So if the police came to my house and somebody called the police and said, oh, he has drugs, he has this, and they lied, the police would show up or CPS or animal control. I don't have kids, animal control. And they'd see everything's fucking fine. Is it fucked up to do? Yes, it is. I'm not denying so are you that. welcoming it? Are you saying that you want people to do that? But what I'm, I'm saying, saying is either. do not fucking push people to their limits wow. on here because we actually fucking show. I'm not going to say anything that's going to get me in trouble, but you've done a lot of nasty things to me. What, what should I do? Because you pushed me to my limits in your opinion, say Robbie. But oh, this guy's crazy. This guy is really crazy. Bro. Our lives, we show ourselves and people use that as a weapon and say, well, you put that out there and they, they use it to abuse you. Like that's their right to fucking use that to use it against you. And it's not okay. <laughs> Making a video about somebody's abuse now. That's crazy. Wait, can I just say something else? And Sally, I'm not, I'm not disagreeing. I love you. I'm just saying it's, it's fucked up. I love everybody, but I'm just saying yeah, that it gets to the stage where you feel like your, your household, your family are being harassed so badly. Log off. This isn't real. This is not real yeah, life. Yeah, but when we log off, they don't That's life. your opinion. That's your opinion. Life life when when else, then that's real life. How about people become adults and stop getting off bullying other people on the internet? How's I that? Agree. Because that's, that's the better answer. But that's what I'm saying. Because yeah, what happens true. when somebody bullies you? You knock them the fuck out in real life. So yeah, how do you do that true. online? So I'm not saying it's okay to go after children, but fuck you, bitch. If you want to hurt me, I'm going to hurt you too. Yeah, but Ruby, how do you do it online? One, you turn the bloody computer off or you go legal. Well, that's something we're all learning together, yeah, for sure. For reason. These niggas, first of all, how many years does it take for you to learn that lesson? Also, you're a grown man. Laura's a grown ass old lady. Bullying? Bullying? You can't get bullied as a grown adult. Cut it out, nigga. People are allowed to do videos on you. It's okay. You know, see me cry. I've never doxed anybody. Never tried to get somebody's channel taken down, none of that shit. To put another child at risk of being ripped apart from his course, mother. Yeah. We've seen this happen in real life. This isn't real life. If you're getting so badly affected by what's happening here, turn it off, walk away. What's going to happen? What is going to happen? <sighs> But well, I get that. Phone, it, it, if you pick up that phone and you make that call and say, God forbid it, that CPS go around to that house when something isn't quite oh right God, and that child gets ripped away from its parents. She's right. <laughs> like, just turn the computer off, bro. Like, what's wrong with you? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's, you know, as, as a child myself losing my mother when she died, she died when I was seven, I can only imagine what a child would feel like being dragged away from its mother. That's mm -hmm. me. And I just want to say one thing too. Can you put yourself in that parent's shoes? How would you yeah, because she has been there. She has. Well, they've how, they've how gone after her then? kids. How do you feel then? Not good. I think that's why she did it in return, but I'll let her well, doesn't, what, So it had, it has anyone time. been taught what... Like, just highlight Jerry's up there. Yeah, but before I do, can I just say one thing? What is the most fucked up thing you guys did three years ago? Can you guys say? I don't do messed up things to people, bro. It's not my style. Three years ago? Three years. Um, Took someone's seat on public transportation. Three years, nigga, any years ago. I think the worst thing I've probably ever done, somebody gave me the wrong amount of change and I didn't correct them. I kept the money. And the most fucked up thing was I supported NC. Yep. That's it. I believe any, so. Any, uh, well, no, I'm not saying like, I don't believe I'm saying like, <laughs> uh, like for me, um, three years ago, uh, I fucking dox you. people that pissed me off and dox me too. First. Um, you see so, how he's lying. You see how he's lying. You see, I've never doxed this man. This thing is filthy. The filthy liar. Okay. If you, if you can't say it out loud or if you can't think of it right now to you or anybody in chat, 
three fucking years ago. Okay. And I don't care if who it involves <laughs> elderly kids, whoever. Okay. Do you want somebody throwing that shit in your face right now? If they found out today and, and, wow. and I understand like what Sally Ann is saying, I do. A oh my gosh. How dare you tell me how I called CPS on a mother and tried to get her children taken away? How dare you? How dare you? Hold on. Where's my picture at? Where's it at? How dare you? How dare you? Why well, Greta sound like a like a witch? I put a spell on you. <laughs> You will be mine. Looking ass. Uh, but yeah, that's that's pretty crazy, bro. <laughs> I don't know how you could do stuff to people and then you be a victim. Agree with, by the way, Celian. I do. Like, and Lonnie. Yeah, just, just, but you have to understand, Laura is probably in a way different mentality right now. In a way different fucking place. And so preaching to her, she's probably going to be like, yeah, dude, I learned from that. Thank I didn't you. tell anybody. Thank I was you. fucked up. I didn't say anything. But yeah, I already know. And <laughs> people are... the. He said three years ago, I didn't let the lady with three things go in front of me in the grocery store line. No CPS was involved. Now nah, that's facts. That's facts. I do that all the time. And I will go ahead if somebody let me skip them too. I will not let somebody skip me. I don't care. I don't care. And if we get on public transportation, I'm not getting up. Yeah, I'm not giving my seat to nobody. Mm -hmm. I'm chilling and I'm spreading my legs out. Right. That's the worst I've ever done to anybody. Right. I think I slam dunked on my little brother. Told him he's never going to be able to beat me in basketball. He cried and ran off. That was probably the worst. <laughs> cried and ran away. I was like, yeah, and that's why you never going to beat me. Outrage is new, but it's probably not new to her because she probably afterwards, like any human being does, like we have <laughs> guilt. You have to you make know? people and with it. You grow. Time. Yeah. And, and she's not being dishonest about it. She's like, well, fuck, it was outed. Dude, listen, if my closest friends outed my motherfucking shit that I have said or Which said that bad. I wanted to fucking do, I've literally said for entertainment purposes only that I wanted to stab people to death for entertainment oh purposes only God. to my closest friends. If they outed that shit and put me, can you imagine the outrage? Oh my God, I can't believe he said that. Everybody does fucked up shit. And if you say he you don't, you're fucking lying. I don't care if it involves children. said that about me. He definitely didn't say that. <laughs> Trin, sure. Your vengeance and your revenge, whether it's insulting people's families or their uh, children or their grandma or whatever, you all fucking do it. And so do I. So the okay. first fucking unguilty person. Put insulting people is not the same as calling CPS trying to get somebody's children taken away. I think that's way different, save Robbie, but okay. Put your motherfucking hand up, because I ain't going to see no motherfucking hands. I'm not going to see any. Absolutely. Fucking angel, Robbie. I've done nothing wrong on this platform. No, we all... Uh, listen, I don't care if you actually go real life, okay, or talk about people's families or their parenting, wow. and I am not defending it. What I'm saying is all y'all motherfuckers docs. And I don't care if you say you do it or not, you do it under troll accounts too, motherfucker. Yo, that nigga's insane. I've never doxed anybody in my life. What type of... I don't even have troll accounts. I don't got time for that. <laughs> I don't. And you probably do it with children's names and all this shit, so shut the fuck up. And I'm not saying to you guys, okay? Because I love you guys. Okay. Don't fucking sit there and tell somebody that they did something fucked up that was found out from three fucking years ago. I, I think you absolutely can, especially if they haven't shown any signs of growth. I think you you absolutely can. He's he's a bugged out person. So he's just full fledged defending her nastiness, huh? He just full fledged. But apparently there's more. Let's just see the, the actual leaks. Let's get the actual leaks up here. But I just know where I stand on this. Fine. I'm not that I heard it, but I I can. The heck is that? No, that's a wrong leak. Wait, why is it giving me this link? That is strange. Yo, that's crazy. That just sent me to another Laura video. That's a whole different thing. Give me a second. 